Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Today in the NA. I'm Vinny Paracelli. We've got a great St. Patrick's Day show coming up for you today. There are about 10 games left in the regular season for most NAHL clubs. We will take a look at the playoff push and highlight our Read to Succeed initiative. But first, let's get to those latest college commitments. Bismarck Bobcats forward Quinn Rudrud has committed to the University of Alaska Fairbanks. He leads the Bobcats to 25 goals so far this season through 50 games played. He's a two-time Top Prospects Tournament participant. He had two goals and four points over the two days in Pittsburgh. Over the course of his NHL career, Rudrud has 29 goals and 56 points. St. Cloud Norseman defenseman Gunnar Johnson has committed to St. Olaf College. The Edina Minnesota native has five assists through 46 games this season. In 90 career games with Norseman, he has one goal and nine points. Jacob Onstad of the Shreveport Mudbugs has committed to Aurora University. Onstad has a goal in 15 points through 47 games this season. He was a part of last season's Robertson Cup Championship team, and for his NHL career, Onstad has 6 goals and 24 points. We continue to highlight teams in our NHL Read to Succeed initiative. This week, we got East teams taking part. The Johnstown Tomahawks were out encouraging local elementary students to use reading as a way to grow and develop in life. Every student who reaches the monthly reading goal earns a prize, like free Tomahawks tickets or autographs from players. The team has gone out into the community multiple times throughout the program with their players to read to and interact with students. Most recently, they went to two different schools to read and celebrate Dr. Seuss's birthday on March 2nd, where some of their players read their favorite Dr. Seuss books to local students. The Maine Nordiques have also been out in the community as they celebrated Dr. Seuss's birthday as well and have been encouraging kids to read all month long. The Danbury Junior Hattricks and Northeast Generals have also been doing their part this month in our Read to Succeed initiative. Back to the action on the ice, New Jersey Titans have a chance to clinch the first playoff spot in the Robertson Cup playoffs if they get a point this weekend. They are also trying to secure the division title as they host Maryland. They currently have an 11 point lead with 10 games left. A sweep wouldn't officially give them the division, but it would make it extremely difficult for the Black Bears to catch up. Then we've got a Central Division battle between the Minotauros and the Bobcats. Minot has a 5 point lead over Bismarck for the final playoff spot in the Central Division. The Bobcats are the hottest team in the division as they are 8-2 in their last 10 games. Minot is coming off a weekend where they were swept by first place St. Cloud. You can watch every North American Hockey League game on Hockey TV. Be sure to follow the league on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube for the latest news and notes. And for up to the second scores and standings, check out NAHL.com. That's going to do it for us here on Today in the NA. Be sure to join us next week when we bring you the latest from the North American Hockey League.